Hey everyone, welcome back to the third episode of the Modern Magic 6 playthrough. I'm your host, Huey Plays. And please subscribe and like this video if you like what you see and want to join in on this journey with me as we play and complete Modern Magic 6. Um, I did a bit of shopkeeping before the video, um, so I sold a couple of items and rearranged some stuff, nothing too major. Thought I'd do that off camera. Um, so in the last video, we just pretty much went around um, New Sorbagul and um, that's as far as we can max it out. Um, yeah, we went around New Sorbagul, we cleared out some enemies, uh, opened some chests and stuff, but we haven't gone into any dungeons yet. I thought I'd save that for this episode and pretty much from here on out. Um, I thought we would start by clearing out Goblin Watch Keep. Um, for some reason, growing up, when I used to play, uh, it used to scare me for some reason. Maybe it was the skulls and just the vibe of the place. I don't know. Um, but I'm ready to tackle it now as an adult. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, I reckon we'll tackle this first. Um, and it should be, should be a good ride. So let's... Go and cast Wizard Eye. Oh, from memory, I don't. Oh no, I do have Torchlight. No, I couldn't remember exactly what I did last episode. Um, so I obviously got Fire Magic and got the Torchlight, which is good. Um, let me just go through. You know, I don't have Spirit Magic next. Uh, yeah. Um, yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Next, I think I'll get uh, Spirit Magic for Pedro. Uh, that way I can cast uh, Bless, um, Heroism, and get some good uh, stat boosting stuff. So, what I'll do is save it before we go in, which you should always do. Uh, we shouldn't have any dramas here, but you never know. So, let's get started. Um, yada yada. Alright, let's go in. Okay. This place is a bit eerie. Ah, the nostalgia is hitting me hard right now. <laughs> God. Down here is the goblins and all the chests, I remember. So, I think there should be rats. Um, I need to remember which way is down. Is it end? D delete. Okay. So, delete on my keyboard makes me look down. End resets me in the middle. And page down, for some reason, makes me go up. Figure that one out. <laughs> so we'll look down. So from memory, there's some rats here. I have good memory. They are the easiest enemies to kill, pretty much. So they're no dramas. Um. Okay. Hopefully, there's no uh, goblin kings. Not too many of them. We should be able to handle them anyway. What I like to do is try and go to the edges here so I can peek through. See how the enemies here, the curse on the minimap, uh, they don't see me yet. But these ones do, so I should be able to focus on these. There shouldn't be any dramas. Aha, uh -huh, so our first uh, goblin shaman. So we've got the green as the easy uh, like novice level enemy. Blue is your intermediate, so the good old shaman here. Oh, he's running off already. Then obviously in the last episode we took on the Goblin King, which is the Ret, and it pretty much applies to every enemy in the game, including rats. Um, I think it's a fire rat, a lightning rat, it's not, uh, the highest one there. Aha, uh -huh, speaking of Goblin King, oh, okay, this tool. Okay, back off a bit. Going to turn based here, we'll take them on as they come around the corner. Pablo is just slaying them. Um, oh, yeah, before the video, I went to the fountain in New Sorpical and got the might boost um, just while I get it, um, especially for these goblin kings here. Alright. Okay. When this situation is presented to you, you back off. Take it one at a time. 
And turn base is crucial for moments of these. But look at that. Got rid of him, no, wor no worries. Get rid of the shaman, no doubt. There we go. Pablo inflicting 19 damage already. What a beast. Alright. Ooh. Doing some damage there. Easy peasy. Off to a good start. Uh, I think Torchlight already ran out. Because obviously I only just got it, so I only got one point, which is not ideal, but we'll push through. Uh, save. I think Charlotte's. Yeah, Charlotte's the disarm. With uh, a level 3, she should be able to open these, no worries. So. Go through these little doors. Um, none there. I think this one. Yes. Okay. So I'll save uh, just in case it does. But yeah, that's fine. Haha, -ha, the Goblin Watch code. Yes, we'll need to use that. I think I remember the code. I think it's Goblin spelt backwards from memory. Um, goblin. So, Nilbog, pretty sure. We'll, we'll try it out anyway. Um, yes, Pedro's identified item, so we'll give it to Pablo to sell, because he'll be our merchant person. Keep going along here. Alrighty. Can't go wrong with some gold, and we got our first cloak. I don't know. Pretty sure it's called a Phantom, I think it's plus three. I need to get my identifier uh -huh. skill up. We'll sell the cutlass. We'll give the who is our alchemist? Okay, so Pedro. Um Alright, so who's got the lowest armor class here? So Pedro? It should be plus three, yeah. Plus three. Um so he's in double digits now, which is good. So we need to get Stephanie up and Charlotte as well. Um should be okay. Um, here we're going along here. On the side note, how good is the music? I think that's also what used to scare me as a kid. Just like it sets the environment, sets the sets the tone, you know, that eerie music. But now I can appreciate just like how it just sets the mood, and I love it. <laughs> All right, so. Aha, uh -huh, we got. Uh -huh. <laughs> I said, haha, Pedro goes, aha. Uh -huh. We'll get an upgrade to our mace with Pedro. I mm. uh, will sell the spear in the club. And from memory, I don't think there's any more chests. No, okay. Um, so this should see an increase. Look at that. 8 to 14, up from 6, which is what you want. I uh, will sell the hammer. Um, it worked! the herb in there. Alright, so we've cleared our first room, which is which is good. Um, we can't go through here yet, because it comes through the other side. we we'll go to the main passageway here. I think I want to go here first, because in there is where you use the code, if I remember right. Yes, okay. Oh, these things used to scare me as well. Look at their mouths. <laughs> Bleep, weird bleep things. Um, these are the kill. And then we've got rats here as well, and more of those bloodsucker things. Good thing we learnt bows. Easily get rid of them. Easy as that. Um, I think Wizard Eye ran out, so we'll cast that again. Alright. Okay, there's enemies there. Um, got one shot, one kill. Alright, and then cast Torchlight, Kate's running out. Then we're gonna run up here. Okay, they're behind there anyway, that's alright. Um, we'll get the gold. I don't know. 
really can't identify those boots. I don't know. Maybe they're enchanted. Because they're like the most basic boots. We should be able to identify those at two. Um be neat if we already got an enchanted item. But this should unlock the doors, so do that. Uh -huh. Alright. It's definitely rats. Or rat. One shot, one kill. Good job, Pedro. Go in here first. Okay, they're easy, just normal goblins. It's going slow to see a bit harder ones. So here you are, uh, Pedro. Alright, we've got a chest here, so we'll save. Oh, okay. Um, I'll get the indicator back up. Um, I don't know. God, the wand reminds me of um. Oh, what's the next city? We went there in the last episode, but my memory is eluding me right now. Um. Oh. I cannot remember the name of it, but there's know. a. There's like a ruffian's cave, um, and they got oozes in there, and I don't know. the memories are coming back of needing ones to kill the oozes, because you can only kill them using spells, and the parties I used to run, there was only like one spellcaster, so it was a nightmare, so I had to get some wands, so we'll hang on to that. Huh. I've learnt my lesson. Uh, we'll sell the spear, sell the bow. Know. I don't know. Okay. Um, go to the merchant. I don't know. Okay, we're making good progress here. We'll go to the other side. Um, these are definitely the rats. Or the bloodsuckers. Here's another screen grab right there. Love those pixels. Um, alright. Okay, must be more magic seven fire and lightning rats. Um, so it goes common, large. Maybe this one's still a fire rat. Can't remember. Um, I'm sure we'll encounter them at some point. Um, okay, so we've cleared out here. Um, we'll heal up uh, Pablo a bit. And Pedro, save. Okay, this is the main uh, corridor. We'll draw out here. He still hit us. Charmin. Bob's your uncle. Alright. Okay, we'll need a heal and hit your. Yep. I think that normally means an item gets broken, I yes. Ugh. That's alright. Um, does anyone have repair? No. I want to give a repair to someone else. Um, maybe we'll do merchant and repair for Pablo. We'll see. Maybe Charlotte, because it's the sound trap. Yeah, we'll fix it. Um, right. Come on, guys. Where is running away? Which is what you want. Okay. Uh, do I still have a shield on me? Any chance? No, okay. Uh, we'll put the boots on you, uh, Pedro, as your shield is broken. Oh yeah, that's enchanted. Plus four and plus three speed. Oh yeah, I bet it's like... I have trouble saying TH words, because I'll have a tongue tie. Um, so bear with me. <laughs> um, so, these boots will probably have plus three arm class. But the increase in speed by three as well makes it so that gets gives us plus one so that makes sense so we've got that here we are um yes the code all right um let's go over the, the code just to see how it works oh here's a key yeah i i reckon it's Neil Bog. We'll see how we go. Um, N. G H 
job. And I L B B O uh G. Hoo hoo! I have good memory. Even though I couldn't, re I can't remember the name of the next town. I can remember the code. So we've got a new Sorbical, we got... Oh, I feel like it's so easy. If I che check my quest. Castle Iron Fist, that's the name. <sighs> yeah, alright. So we'll continue on here. Easy peasy. It's so satisfying when everyone shoots the... Uh, shoots arrows at once. Just something satisfying about that. That pleases my OCD. Alright. Um... We'll cast Torch and um, Wizard Eye again. We'll save. Let's open this big door. So, Brain Sucker would be in the middle. So, we've got the Blood Suckers, Brain Suckers, and I think Soul Sucker is the last one. A oh, giant right, yep. Yeah, it must be my Magic 7 then. That has like the elemental rights. We'll definitely play my Magic 7 if I actually get through this playthrough, which, as I've said in another video, uh, over the years I've been up and down with my uploading. Um, I've gone through different phases, um, high school, uh, personal things that have gone on, motivation, yada yada. Um, but I am committed. Oh, I've got poison. No disease. Not ideal. Oh, that's okay. Um, but at the moment, I am committed to making these videos for you guys. Um, okay. And we'll see how it goes. But if I do get through this, I do intend on playing my Magic 7, 8, 9. Um, I've got 10 as well, but I've never played it, to be honest. Um, I think I've got that on new play or something. Um, I've also got uh, Mind Magic 1 to 5 um, through uh, good old games. Um, I can give those a crack too, potentially. We're pretty talking years down the track. Um, but that's alright, we'll, we'll get there eventually, won't we? Um, alright, so Hedro's Disease. Do I have any. So I'm used to uh, the other minor magics where oranges, excuse me, cure disease. Um, Alright. I think I will go back to town and we'll, um, we'll heal up, we'll sell some stuff. Um, because I don't want to go down and have Pedro deceased and have a broken shield. He's gone through too much already. Haven't you poor Pedro? Look at ya. Sick as a dog you are. We'll get you healed up though. Um, alright, so. We'll go to the temple, which is up at this away. Is it purple that heals? I feel like that uh, cures poison, not disease. I'm not sure. And gold's nothing. Easy peasy. Alright. Um, I think this one is the spell point, so this one would be might. No, I've still got it in effect. That's alright. Um, alright, Pablo. It's closed. Of course. We'll wait until dawn. We won't make the same mistake I made in Castle Iron Fist, where. I was trying to wait until dawn, that was my intention, but I rested and healed and used up some food, which was a nuffy move on my part. Um, but, you know, we learned from our mistakes, and I think that's a valuable life lesson, and we're applying it right now, so... But we are weak, um, so we might have to use food to rest. Um, <laughs> Alright, we'll sell some stuff. Uh, Again, Let's see what weapon. weapons you have. Ooh. I like your daggers. 
Um, does anyone have a dagger? No. I know sorcerers have daggers, but druids are using a staff. Um, that's okay. Um, for a weapon. what else do you have? Yeah, pirate cutlass. Um, we've got one last episode, so we'll sell the armor here. Um, don't touch the merchandise. I have a need to repair. Um, because that goblin king uh, didn't like us and took it down Pedro, so. Oh, you can do that. Okay. Um, we give Pedro some chain armor, I reckon, because he's copping it a bit. Um, okay, so we'll identify these as well. Um, okay, so I reckon we'll get some armor here, considering we've got over 2,000 gold. We should be able to get a few stuff. Um, who's in most need? We're all pretty balanced. We'll see what they have. Um, See if we can get a helm for Pablo. Uh, pretty much anything but armor for Charlotte. Uh, we'll I don't know. definitely give Pedro some chain if they have any. And Stephanie will see if we can get her something too. Uh, we'll share the load. In a generous mood today, so uh, we'll identify these. Um, yeah, so I was right. Um, Oh no, plus two. Okay, so the plus three gave us bonus of two, which is interesting. Um, we'll give it to Charlotte. Look at that. So we've got 12, 11, 11, and 9. Um, okay, so... Don't touch the merchandise. Okay, so we don't have any chain. we got some gauntlets. Uh, that's not really... Crucial enough for me to get. Um, what do we have here. Okay, so he doesn't have any chain. I thought they might have had the basic chain, to be honest. Um, that's okay. Um, I reckon we'll get some gauntlets because they're some decent armor. Um, all right, we'll get that, that, and that. Come back that should do us. Uh, we'll give that to Charlotte. We'll give that to Pedro. And to Sh... Pablo. Uh, we'll do that. And then we'll have a look at... Oh, she already had some. Alright, we should be able to go to Charlotte then. There we go. Alright, so if we have a look now, so we've got... Um, Pablo of 18, we'll try to um, use him as a tank so we'll beef up his armor class and um, damage. Um, Charlotte has 14, which is very solid for an archer early on. Um, Pedro 17, which is very good. And Stephanie 14. So we're off to a good start here. Um, oh, you know, I can't be stuffed going to the temple, which is just, just there, so we'll heal. Um, I oh know, lazy of me. Um, Closed. I was going to say what enemy I had to kill. Um, Alright, so I reckon we'll go back to the Goblin Watch Cave. Um, I don't know how long this video has been going for. I should probably uh, keep track of that <laughs> somehow. Um, if I had to guess, it's probably about. 20 minutes, maybe 25. So we'll go back in here. Um, we'll cast um, good old um, Wizard Eye and Torchlight once we get to the entrance down below. Um, and we'll save for sure. Um, I will cast Wizard Eye first and Torchlight. Okay, so, can okay, anyone level up actually? Okay, we'll miss that. Alright, the yeah, accept. Alright, so we'll head down below, we'll take a plunge. Okay, just making sure no one's there. Aha, uh -huh. they're all chests, I remember. These are goblins, and some will, and rats. 
uh, from memory, goblins will spawn after I open the chest. And for bonus points, I think they are goblin shamans. So we'll see how we go. Um, oh, brain suckers can give the disease, can't they? Need to kill though. I have a feeling they might run out. Yeah. We're still easily getting them. Good. Ready for this. Boom. 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 Those rats. Alright. Alright, let's see how good my memory is again. We'll start. Ooh, don't start a new game. Jesus. <laughs> that would have been a stitch up and a half. Um, but thankfully we realised. Alright. Do your magic, Charlotte. Um, go over here first. Ooh, ooh, look at this guy. Right as I buy gauntlet, we get a good gauntlet. I don't know. I need to beef up that I've done the skill. Pink Charlotte. I'm not sure he knows so. Okay, no dramas. Um, so that. Identify that. Alright, so. It might be a certain chest or all of them, but I swear I remember some spawning. Aha! Uh -huh. Yes! Bonus points for you. Alright. Get rid of these buggers. Spam A. Oh, hello. Didn't expect to see you. Okay, thanks for the ring. Um, Alright, so heal. Step up. Alright. Ooh, good old cart shield. One until he gets up there. Uh -huh. um. uh -huh. ah. Oh, we don't need line anymore, do we? Because um, we were collecting them up this last episode, because I thought I might not be able to get fire magic for a while. Um. Right, so Pablo's got tower shield, and Pedro does too. I was thinking we might be able to use that. Um, oh, I think that's a halberd. I don't maybe. know. Yeah, halberd. Oh, no, no. Oh, right, right. Range. That's all right. Um, mm, so I, don't I, don't know. I think that's a decent sword. Uh -huh. We'll use a hat. I don't know. And we'll compare the pair. Oh, even better. I don't know. Look out. One less attack rating, but I think the damage makes up for that. So, there you go. I wasn't expecting to get a better sword than that for a while. Straight off the bat. Just know. get a broad sword that's like, yeah, we'll give you three extra damage. No worries. Take that. Um, Alright, who has the lowest hit points? For some reason, Pedro is uh, taking the hits. I don't know why, so we'll give the hat to him, see if it makes a difference. Save. Collect these bodies. Ugh, need it. Some fire magic. Tell you what, I think I'm close to actually clearing this out. Because uh, we're going to want to fort. Remember, I thought it took. A lot longer than this, actually. I may have spoke too soon, though. Alright, we'll see how we go. Oh, yeah, I remember this part. Oh. God, there must be a lot of goblins. So I'm not having a good time. Should be able to take these out. Um, focus on the king. Not doing much damage. There we go. You can use the cursor to specifically target someone, so 
like ordinarily if it wasn't the king I'd just be spamming A but that automatically targets the front enemy but with the cursor I can specifically target this bloke over here now I can press A there we go goes down like a sack of potatoes Go over here, see. See, they don't, they don't run over here, but we can still hit them. It's a. Are you serious? A common rap. Um, yeah, that's a good uh, little hack for Martin Magic. You can like, go like that and sneak attack. Oh, I need that. Aha! For um, Pedro. Well, his arm class is almost higher than his hit points. He's doing well. Um, yeah, we need to learn cure disease. I've got weakness. We will heal you up, Charlotte. Don't you worry. Get you, get you better. Oh yeah, um, rings. Uh, in the rat. Um, where's this one? Mm. Alright. Um, we'll heal Pablo. Save and we'll keep on going. Uh, we'll go over here. Because I like going left to right. Okay, so we've got Shaman. Okay, we've got another Shaman too. Shamans aren't too bad, especially compared to the kings that shoot fire. And obviously have a lot more hit points. Shamans have nothing. Oh, fire magic. And wizard eye as well. Ooh. We'll share the live with our uh, magic casting Charlotte, don't you worry. Alright, so we've got John right here. So you can see, like, I'm trying to go around the corner to try and, like, get a sneak attack, but they already know I'm here, so it's not really as valuable. It's nice to see how many enemies there are. And Pedro, you're still taking a lot of damage. What's going on, buddy? Um. Alright. Alright. We definitely need to learn cure disease. Go back and find suckers, uh, give me a bit of trouble with them. Oh god. Alright. Okay. We'll heal, step up. Okay, everyone's getting diseased. Um, <laughs> um, you know, it's not fair if just one person in the party has it, everyone has to get it. So, Steph, you're up next. Um, should be okay, though. Um. I don't know. Ooh, that... I don't know. That is a good one. It does less damage, but more attack. Ooh. Think we'll go... Oh, everyone's, uh, that's a way down, to be expected, if you were diseased. Um, we'll see what enemies are next. If they're too much, we'll go back, heal up. Oh yeah, I spoke too soon, there's still a fair bit to go. Alright, we'll see if we can take these guys on. No disease. We'll see if we can go here. Yes. Let's try and see, single them out. Look at that. Only took a bit of damage. Bob's your uncle. Oh, Hit with a round. Uh, come on, Pablo. No disease, buddy, but need a bit more oomph. No shots. Right. 
Hey, well. We should be able to take these girls. I don't mind taking damage. I know I'm gonna survive it. Here you are, chart. Um, we're taking a bit of a beating here. Um, but what's a game without a fight? Without a challenge? And I love myself a good challenge, so. Uh, Wizard Eye gone. Um, he's on this side. Three Goblin King. So, okay. we're back in the other day. <laughs> Alright. We'll take out these guys. Oh, God. Alright. It's a bit tougher than what I thought. We'll reevaluate here. We'll heal up. He's running our support points. Um, we'll save. And we'll take these guys out. And I reckon I'll heal back up at town. And probably finish the rest of this in the next episode. That's my thinking. So I reckon we can do that. Sure. Okay. Uh, heal up. Take out the king. Ugh. Unconscious, our first KO of the playthrough. Far out, alright, come on, let's go. There we go. We should be able to take these guys out. Ugh. Yeah, we're definitely going to heal up back in town after this. Come on, I believe in you guys. I know the odds are big against you at the moment, but, you know, don't give up. Alright, let's go for the kill. Stop here. Let's go. That was a bit ambitious on my part. <laughs> Alright, um. That did stuff all, because I think the wall blocked that. Uh, spell points. Oh, I was hoping. Use the spell points and then be able to straight up heal me back. Uh, Alright, come on guys, let's kill him. Come on, a bit less than halfway there, come on. Come on guys, let's do this. No taking a battering. Come on, I'm almost there. No there we go. Alright. I will not inflict any more damage to you guys. You guys have been through the rigors. We'll go back. I was re <laughs> I thought I might have been stuck there because of like where we went down the hole, how we meant to get back up. But it connects back here, which I'm very thankful about. Uh, so we're going to definitely go back to town. We'll. Uh, See if we can buy more spells. We can't level up yet. Um, I was hoping to get more points into fire magic for Steph. Because um, torchlight running out frequently isn't ideal. Um, but we can still see, and um, it's not using too much spell points, so she'll be right. I see you've increased your uh, how much it costs to heal disease. Uh, what's your name? Can we assist Joshua. Be with you. Getting my money, mate. Um. Okay, so we'll sell this and identify and repair the stuff we got. Um. Identify that. Um. And then yeah, I think we'll finish the episode here after all that um, and we'll get stuck in to the rest of Goblin Watch Keep. We should definitely be able to finish it next episode. What is the time? It's pretty light out for 7.30.
Um, a bit deceiving there. Um, so yeah, we'll um, re-evaluate. Um, we don't sell that. I can't use it, can I? Um, yeah, so we really, really, re-evaluate. Um, take out the rest of the goblins down there. Don't touch the merchandise. Um, oh, no, no. And we'll uh, probably get cracking on the abandoned temple as well, potentially. Um, depends on how much time we spend at the cave. Um, who's got a crappy goal? We'll help you out, Charlotte. Um, Don't touch the merchant. So yeah, that's the thinking. Um, Come back soon. I think that's a good plan. Um, so we'll sell out the rest of the stuff it's and we'll see if we can buy anything. Can I help you find anything? What am I doing with the alchemist? Um, wait, can no. Can I help you find anything? Yeah, I was reading too much into it now. Um, okay, we'll identify these guys. Repair you, uh, to sell. Um, identify you and you. Starburst is a good air magic spell for later in the game. So we'll definitely do that. Uh, we'll sell these guys. Um, identify this one. Sparks. Alright, we're definitely going to hang on to that. For the oozes I was talking about, which will be... They're pretty much my kryptonite. I, uh, find anything? hate them. <laughs> um, but we'll figure it out as we go along. Um, plus one might is useless. Uh, cold resistance. Just seeing what they have. Yeah, purple's poison. Yeah, okay. Um, okay, so they didn't have anything to note there. God, I don't have to get right. What are you looking at? Um, leather, leather. I don't think I want to learn those. Uh, we haven't done any quests yet, so can't get any rewards. Um, Closed. oh my god. I need your help. What do you want? Ah. Well, apparently that worked. Even though, still going. <laughs> Thanks for the uh, 2,000, Janice. To finish, to finish... We can't pay you, but you can have it. Um, so what do they want? The Chime of Harmony. A cult has moved into the abandoned temple. Okay. Um... But where's quest? So yeah, the abandoned temple is definitely the next place to go after the keep. So we got the... Okay, no, the temple of bars in um, House of Lion Fist, don't worry. Sorry for the silence there, my dog was just having a weird, uh, making weird noises, and I think she's having dreams. Um, <laughs> bit random. Uh, she'll be alright. She does that a fair bit. Um, must be having a good dream. Um, yeah, we'll get that back to you, uh, Pablo. Let's see what else we got here. Things just the same as last time. Don't touch the merchandise. You know what, I'm feeling very generous. I'm gonna spend good money on that. Come back. And I'm gonna give it to Stephanie. And we can level up. Okay. Everything's happening. Uh Steph. What is your hit points gonna be? 32, that's is what we want to see. Uh who's got the least of you two armor class? I'll go with Charlotte. Um sell that. Okay, so we're doing a bit more than what I thought back in town. Um, but that's okay. That's the unpredictability of minor magic. Um, 
Alright, so we'll level up. Pretty sure it's over here. <coughs> yes, sir. Okay. Okay. Alright, good stuff. So, we've got six points. Um, I'm kind of tempted to save it for either repair item or um, merchant. Um, yeah, I reckon we'll see if we can get merchant. Uh, I'll give you... Give you one more on disarm trap, so we can get expert, so I don't have to worry about that for a little bit longer. Um, more so peace of mind, then I can focus on other skills. Um, Pedro, identify item. And mates, because your rating's a bit low. Uh, Steph, we were talking about it before, fire magic. And... Air magic as well, so it lasts for three hours. Um, Closed. I think I can learn merchant here. I'm hoping anyway. Um, well, look who's here. Yes, yes. Okay. I'll learn merchant from here. I think it's good to everyone that has merchant. Couldn't be without it. Um, Couldn't be without it. Yeah, cheers, Hermit. Um, yeah, look, so the skill's already gone down by 10%. Um, and we'll pump it. Alright, so 135, uh, just for learning merchant, we'll pump skill points into that, well, look who's and here. down to 126. So, as we get, like, expert merchant and master merchant, ultimately, we'll get down to, like, 80, 70 even. Uh, so, like, half price, which is what you want. So, we'll definitely do that. Um... I don't think it's worth learning dagger. Um, I was hoping they had repair item. Um, I need to figure out where to learn that. Um, keep the pa Pablo can be like the quest item holder as well. Um, so we'll just hold it in the corner. Uh, Charlotte's TBD with her. Uh, Pedro the spells. Um, you know what, Charlotte, you can be the item holder for like use later on. So fly and uh, sparks for the oozes. And Stephanie, I don't know. <laughs> we'll figure it out. So our new uh, stats, so we leveled up um, 54 hit points, 34, 32, 34. So we're looking good there. Um, and I think we will finish the episode off there, to be honest. Um, so we've been to the Goblin Watch Keep. We've uh, cleared out a few rooms. Uh, in the next episode, we'll go back. We'll clear it out. Um, and yeah, we'll uh, keep going in New Sword School. Um, but that's about it for this video, guys. Uh, if you made it this far, again, I genuinely appreciate you means a lot to me um, let me know what you think of the video how I'm going so far give me feedback little tips uh, much appreciated um, but again thank you for sticking by I appreciate you and I'll see you in the next one here we out cheers <laughs>